Hello and welcome to the Lusaka Markets video from the Best of Zambia, made possible by Kickstarter funds. Today, we are going to visit three markets that give a variety of shopping experiences. Markets in Zambia are a quintessential part of life. You can really experience Zambian culture by going to markets. So we're gonna go around Lusaka. It's gonna be a great time. We're gonna have a great shopping experience. So let's go. Unsanctioned markets are still a problem in Lusaka. Government has taken strides in the last 20 years to formalize businesses by creating spaces in historical market areas for people to be able to do commercial work. One such place is City Market, where you can get all sorts of things from great produce to the famous salawula, which literally means pick and take. If you don't like ready-made clothing, you can also find a tailor here to make something for you. You can also get something to eat here at City Market and seeing as it's lunchtime, I'm going to get something traditional. Okay, so what we have here is nshima, which is made from maize meal or milli meal as we like to call it. Um, this is our staple food and I opted for the fish. Uh, this is very common, we call it bream. It's also known as tilapia. It is nicely fried and I have got rape, which is of the kale family. Um, so um, let's see how this uh, tastes. Ooh. That's a bit hot. <laughs> so the way that you eat in Shima is you take off a bit with your fingers and then you press it until you can make a little pocket. So then if there was gravy in here, you could also put the gravy inside. And then you pick the food. Mm -mm -mm. So here we are at the second market, Kawata Cultural Village. This is the place where you can come seven days a week and find anything that you want. Jewelry, curios, stuff for your house, whatever it is that you can possibly think of, it is here. There's material and huts and huts and huts full of amazing, amazing things. Mm. 60, 50, donated through Kickstarter in order for this video to be possible. A special thank you also to Sandy's Creations and Daybreak Butchery, the two proudly Zambian businesses that footed the majority of the bill. Sandy's Creations is best known for being a wedding venue, but it is so much more. Here at the lodge, we have 13 chalets with twin and double rooms. We also have a restaurant that serves traditional Western and Asian cuisine. Okay, our conference facility is actually, it has got three venues. Uh, it's a big hall, but it can be divided into three parts. And then um, those uh, venues, actually, we accommodate uh, different clients that actually have conference in Sunday's creation. Daybreak Farm Butchery has been a proudly Zambian establishment since 1978. We are Debrek, we process uh, uh, pork products uh, ranging from uh, ham, bacon, salami and uh, Russian sausages and all manner of sausages you can think of. We also stock fresh beef 
choice choice beef. We also have milk, uh, full cream milk. We hope and, uh, and looking forward to seeing you here at Debrick Farm so that you can tap into the best of the best in Zambia.